boozers and welcome to another booze reviews today i have got something well watch on sales i'm going to be doing a series here because i've got a bunch of twin sales if you haven't seen the video yet go watch it it's an unboxing video short sweet just find out today's beer is going to be the con liche and it's a horatia style milk stout Coming in at 7.5% alcohol by volume, 18 IBUs. And it's a strong beer. And this beer contains caffeine. <laughs> well, it's the first time I've seen that in a bit. So we got water, barley, hops, coffee, cinnamon, vanilla, lactose, and yeast. So it actually does have coffee in there for saying it contains caffeine. All right. Well, I kind of need to wake up a little bit. It's been a early day gotta get my stuff going let's see how it is oh the smell already my god that is gorgeous all right so let's see what we have here dark black that's black two fingers worth of tan head on there Hmm. I already smell the coffee and the chocolate from here. I don't even have to put it up to my nose almost. But we're still going to smell it like that. Oh yeah. There's a coffee note on there. Milk chocolate. A little bit of the spices in there. Burnt malts in there too. Oh Jesus, this smells awesome. Alright folks, cheers. Hot damn. You have a beautiful chocolate milk coffee note all throughout it. Not heavy. Not heavy at all. A little bit of the spices on there from the cinnamon, but not overbearing. Everything comes together in a beautiful transitional mouthfeel and taste and just wow this is amazing I'm not gonna lie like this is actually really beautiful I love this um, stout wise I don't know if I really call it a stout I could because it does have all those characteristics of a stout I could call it a deep porter too the way the mouth feels a little bit but it does have that creaminess there that puts it into the stout category that lacing is amazing. Wow. Easy drinking. And this is at 7.5. Can't even taste the alcohol in there. Like this is so easy to drink and enjoy. It's like having a coffee, milk, chocolate goodness in your mouth. The touch of cinnamon just oh, sprinkled on the top. This is a fall beer. Not a, not a winter beer. A fall beer because of the fact that it's not really robust. It's actually really light, um, but it's just, it's beautiful. This is an amazing beer. Uh, for a score, 9.5 out of 10. I love this. This is a great stout. I am seriously not complaining about this beer whatsoever. I love it. Like, wow. I'm glad I actually picked this up. This is one of the ones that I was really excited for. And I can understand why now, because this is right up my alley. Well, time to get some house cleaning done. Because if I, if not, I'm going to be drinking this son of a bitch all, all day, and it's going to be gone, and I'm going to be drunk because the alcohol is very well masked. Right, folks, Till next time, I'm PK saying cheers. Stay frosty. And we'll see you real soon. Twin sales, stop it. You're making me broke. Actually, don't. Make me broke. But maybe uh, we should talk about going on to some sort of payment plan. Yeah, gonna need that. Have a good night. Thanks again.